Hello, 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 welcome to a new Pioneer video. Today we are playing again my favorite deck, it's Ways Not, with the new toys. So this list is inspired, and by inspired I mean copied, from Squirtle19, who just won a Pioneer Challenge like the, uh, this on the 18th, you know, like yesterday basically, because now we have challenges every day or something, I have no idea. So lost right now. And we are going to try the new cards. The list. The only thing I have changed is I have added one in Satiable Our Ease, which is basically three mana target player draws three and loses three life instead of the fourth go blank, which I think four go blanks are way too many. Cards new cards we are going to try. Carback the Punisher, three mana three three. Whenever you commit a crime, that being targeting opponents, anything they control and or cards in the graveyards is a crime. Uh, you, whenever you commit a crime, exile up to one target black card from your graveyard and copy it. You might cast the copy. If you do, you lose two life. So, pretty cool. Right? Like card advantage engine. It's a creature which sometimes we have trouble closing out the game, so that's interesting. And since the ability is what lets you cast the card, there's no timing restrictions. So that means that if in, in your draw step I fatal push your creature, I can recast my thoughts from the graveyard and take your newly drawn card, which is pretty, pretty cool. The other new card, is, well, the, the avarice we have mentioned, this card has a spree, it's black, and then either pay two to do a vampiric tutor, or pay black black to do um, the draw three we mentioned, you can do both. And then there is tiny bones in the cyborg, which is a black, a black one one for a black mana, death touch. Whenever Tiny Bones the pickpocket deals combat damage to a player, you may cast target non-land permanent card from that player's graveyard, and mana of any type can be spent to cast that spell. This seems super powerful. The problem is with Carebreak, with Tiny Bones, with all those kind of cards, we don't want to play creatures that allow our opponents to use their removal spells, no? Because how the deck plays out, I'm going to start joining a league. Here we are. So the way the deck plays out, right, like you are depleting your opponent's resources, you are targeting this card then, and you are taking the wood card, the proactive threats, usually that you don't have answers for, and the card advantage card. And then you are using Lilianas and uh, go blanks, which let them choose what to discard and everything. But it happens a lot that they end up with two cards in hand, one card in hand, and it's a removal spell. When you play a kill tour, oh, I have, a, I do have a removal spell. Why? Because you never took that with thoughts. You never took that with the rest, and it's there. So it's always tricky, right? To choose to play extra tours. You play Seldred or Aklasot. Aklasot because it comes back basically. So the recursiveness is what makes it awesome. And Seldred just wins so fast, so easily, and is so great also at stabilizing you versus aggro decks. It's like way too good not to play, I think. But we'll see about the new cards because I, if you go, if you go to check out the Squirtle's 19 deck, uh, Twitter, so it's Squirtle 19. He was mentioning that he was really, really in love with Carebreak. That he thinks it deserves a definitive spot in the deck. So I hope we get to try that. When I try new cards, I usually like to play several copies. We're playing one of Avaris and Tiny Bones and only two Carbex. But it's just rough, right? To, hey, let's play four of each because they don't really, like, you don't have the room in the deck for that. This hand is medium, but we have double Waste Knot with the Gale Ritz and Ethereum, which, we well, you know, like, I have already recorded two videos with this deck. You can go check them if you want to learn more about it. But, yeah, that is very cool. Getting on. Giganta. What does Giganta mean? Could mean a Transmogrify deck. Could be, be a uh, creature deck like um, Heroic. Seems like Heroic. So I'm happy I kept the Fatal Push hand. Since we only have the one removal spell. Right, because usually you don't. Oh, now we have two. If I wait until the turn, try to kill it, and they go like, ha, save it. 
that's going to suck. But since we have a second removal, we can wait a bit, see what they do. Usually, also, they play quite a bit of two drops, right? Uh, yeah, I'm taking the one. Happy about that. Because if they, they go land, play um, Virtuoso, I'd rather keep that. <clears throat> but usually versus creature decks with pump spells and protection spells you want to kill the creature when they are tapped out but we really want to kill the next that's the one that's the one even though with waste not you know it could things can happen okay going to go kill kill what like kill the monastery and kill whatever is there in the next play we have drawn three fatal pools in eight cards nine cards always lucky always lucky let's say that Salazar okay this name I don't know this name I'm here Petito Attempt to kill it in response, we get our 2 for 1, they will try to protect it and will try to kill it again. And if they, they have the second protection spell, that would be rough. But the first one we can't really beat. But usually, yeah, just. Oh, the second one we are not. Mm. Usually, kill the creature on your main phase okay this was a risk we took and now we are going to pay for it that's a lot of damage we could have been more patient taking the five damage from the monster rage instead of the seven we just took the problem now is we don't really have anything to use i'm going to find a liliana i think i'm going to scry On that. Try to find a Lily or a two mana removal spell. Mm. Yeah, maybe it was too greedy. Could have just killed it in my turn when they were tapped out. They seem out of out of resources, but we are already at nine and they have a two three attacking us. So non trivial. <laughs> Okay. Now if they go land Giganta, put us down to seven, and we find out an answer for Giganta. We don't have many. We have Bitter Triumph, which I really hate as a card. This will gain us for life, which is going to be relevant. And also we are not investing mana on it, unlike Van Buster. Problem with that is that we are going to kill the monastery and the Giganta just going to destroy us. So I don't think I want it. Now we are dead on board. Maybe that was too good TV. That's truly the I truly didn't think there was going to be anything interesting to do. Oh. Mm. <sighs> okay, okay, let's focus, eh? Let's focus. Tiny bones coming in, it's a 1 1 with death. It's fine. Avaris seems, seems bad. Path of Peril seems good. Event seems good. Uh, Goblanks are medium in this matchup, very medium, since they, they deploy their hand so quickly. Yeah, okay, I'm taking out the Goblanks. Dures is fine, some number of Dures are fine. Trespasser is a decent blocker, not 
amazing. So I'm going to go like this. On the play, we have a, a, bit of, a little bit more of options. But yeah, imagine. So ha if I just kill that master to spear and then kill the virtuoso, or if I just kill the virtuoso and then play waste not, and then on the next turn play waste not and another fatal push. And then we have the double waste node with the land and we start doing stuff. I will have been so much fun. First game of the day. It's like I should reasonably I should warm up. Right? Like so why you warm up your body for doing sports, you should warm up before you play magic. A tournament or anything. In this case, a silly internet beef. But I don't have the time for that. Refocus. Okay, on the play, this is probably good enough. Since we have back to back Lilianas and they don't usually play that many creatures, right? Okay, that's a good draw. And they did have a one drop, so that's awesome. Hey, virtuoso, huh? Being on the play feels unfair. Like Liliana and the play and the draw are completely different animals. Of course, if your opponent has a one drop, not so good. But... How are you playing two drops in the face of a Liliana? Yeah, virtuoso. We have another Lilia. I'm waiting. Let me do this first. I assume the rest is going to be um. I do this card like a, and I draw, of course, but they could have only creatures in hand. So God's willing, so on, so on. It's fine. When, whenever you play a discard spell having a waste node, feels unfair. Taking out the path of peril here. Opponent probably going to discard uh, land. Could play Aklason at that point. No, I want to play Aklason. Or is it way too good? No, I think I'm going to play the Aklason. We are unlikely, <laughs> unlikely to die from this situation because they don't really have pump spells, right? They, this is just protection. I would say we are unlikely to die, and if they have to spend their protection spells to attack, they 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 are incentivized to do so because they want to kill Liliana. But we are going to get waste not triggers and probably a castle trigger. And yeah, you, you could die yeah, from this position, but knowing their hand, I think we are fine. I think we should be fine. Now we get a creature, and they get pro white. I didn't discard Kerbeck because I wanted to try it. <laughs> Probably better to discard Kerbeck than Path of Peril. Now what? Are you going to get the Ganta into hand? Are you going to... Lixot Sogov. Okay, pretty cool card. Not very good versus Aklasov. Okay, this is King Liliana, that's perfectly fine. Now we untap. Draw. We are not drawing, we are not going to our doorstep. We to attack with Aklathot and the zombie token. 
they, they can play the God's Willing, they don't have to discard it, but if they don't, we just draw because of their class of ability, so it's pretty fine. Yeah, uh, they can, oh, okay, now they can block my zombie token, oh, that's fine. Draw Okay, reach Right. So I have to Probably Nah that's going to go Lily minus We have used the filler room before to get an, an extra swamp. That would have been interesting. Okay, so they didn't block the zombie token, they blocked the class of so we don't gain for life. They are very low on resources, and they're going to be triggering our stuff with the Illuminator Virtuoso, like drawing a Cesta cards and or giving us extra mana depending on what they discard when they connive. Have a six five. I mean, the thing is big, huh? Wow, they are drawing all the cards that draw extra cards. That's pretty cool. And they, they do have a lot of those. Now I can jump block. We may die here, depending if they found another pump spell. Let's see what they discard. They discarded a land. Wait, wait, wait. Now we don't die because we get the one one. But that was that was quite something. What a turn. We discard the torches. Get another thing. Okay. More luck. The problem now is we don't really have um, a way to kill that virtuoso. Plus Liliana. Yeah, not not having used a filler ruin may come back to bite me. Okay, it's kind of to withdraw a card. That's this might be useful. Attack with that class thought. Draw. I will find another one. Okay. <clears throat> Always lucky. Always lucky. Always like. Yeah, Carbeck seems a bit weak in this matchup. Just a slow. Oh, maybe not. Maybe it's fine, but it seems a bit slow. That was closer than I would have liked it to be. I think I have to bring in the dresses <clears throat> on the draw, especially. Let's go. Well, <clears throat> we're not keeping a hand with the removal or interaction. Easier. Come on. Oh wow wow this is a lot better. Um <clears throat> I want the path, at least two lands, the push to survive, and a fourth one, probably the Dudes at that point. Okay, so I'm going to put down Sanken and Dot Six. We're going to need our plan is going to use the push stop the early development and then the Dures to clear the way and so they can really pump the things they plot the bird 
Bloated berry is scary. We need land. You need us a land? Let me do the SU and see what you have. Anger, anger. Where there? Hmm. That's going to play Castle Logwain because in case they decide they want to play the bird and use the anger on it. They have a very bad hand. Likely for us because I mean, we are on a multi five after all. Where they are. Pathways gone. And they are going to take Giganta into hand. Sweet. This will have the answer for Giganta later. The castle has been a good draw because it helps, it will help us to get um, something going. I expect them to draw a creature at some point, we start deploying our removals, and from there maybe we can use the castle to get back. Castle cost. Probably expect that we have a removal spell again. They have drawn a protection spell, it's going to be rough. Virtuoso too, okay. Do you have another creature? I'm not moving. I'm not moving. I get a two for one. Be nice. It was nice indeed. <clears throat> they go land Giganta. We have the bitter triumph for it. Virtuoso. Why? Right. And to try to kill it now. Outside of combat and everything. Virtuoso is annoying to kill because if they have a protection spell. It's really nice for them. Passing the turn. Like, I could play the waste mode, but they're just going to kill it. So I'm not getting any value out of it. So can sound. In Giganta like this because the Soul Red Edit goes over the protection spells. So I really want to wait for that one. Okay, let's see if they play a creature now. I kind of want to wait until they tap out and I can go waste not to rest, take your where they are, draw a card. Slick sword. Okay. I'm going to take a bunch of damage here, but I think. It's worth it. And as we can see, that is so mid. I get so mid. They, they could go for the slick shot, try to pump it, but the soldier said it. It's going to be so cool in that situation. If they play a second creature, they're a bit low on life. No, so don't the skulls. That's cool. That's cool. Let's see what they find. Escape for mana draw 4, unless you find all pump spells and no creatures. Of course, they can play, they have the a creature plotted, but we have the soldiers edit to protect us from that. Not drawing now with the castle, too much life. I mean, I guess I will play the second ways not now. They can kill it. Empty my hand for the castle to win the game. As it does. If they find a second creature here, we are dead. Basically, I'm telling you this. But if they just have pump spells, we can manage. Wow. 
Bye bye. Oh, get lost. Ooh. That's a lot of anti-enchantments answers. The more you draw of those, you're not drawing creatures that win the game, right? Okay. Click so. One of three Swiss spirit. That's a sick. Now we're dying to a one of three Swiss spirit. I'm not sure if we are dying, but well, we may totally be dead. Yes. They were very smart by starting with a monastery rather than with a um, spell. I think we are dying. We are dead now. That so do so the amount of skulls is going to be a million damage. For those of you who don't remember, puts a plus one plus one counter on that whenever you cast a spell. I shouldn't have taken all the, those damages from the castle. It was three damage. Let's see how relevant it is. Probably going to be pretty relevant. Okay, this is at least six damage. They probably have one more. Oh, they, are, they still have the Antestral Angel. And another monastery, oh my god. Eight. And the in Angel, we are dead. We are dead. But if we hadn't taken those three damage, well, now we'll draw. We'll draw the second waste node. Mm, this was a weird game. This was a very weird game. We had nothing. We had nothing. We just had the sword, the sword on all the skulls, and that's it. Mm. Hate the start in the leagues losing. It just feels terrible. Okay, let's play another one. Okay. <sighs> This is a very good fan. It is. The shot bitch, huh? Well, let's. Could be spirits. Now that I think about this. No. Uh, no more lies. I think if we take the no more lies and resolve a maze mind tome, we just win with it. Blue white control, I think, should be a fine matchup because, like, we both have a million de dead draws. But in the end, ah, it's all out. Oh, okay. Oh, maybe not. I feel you can grind them. Another hand. Let's see if they play the deuce. Deuce, deuce. They didn't. I will take it. It's got an advantage for them. I think our lands are more powerful. And we have like ways to loot our removal again. I don't know. No. I think you can just grind and grind and grind and grind. If they miss a land drop here, that was another reason to I being them I would have played the reduce. Because reduce is a two for one, so you, you play it. Not like me playing the Thoughtseize and taking the Deus took out a 2 for 1 from them versus the the option of them having, having it, right? Like, we basically took 2 cards with 1 and if I take the, the Deus, you don't care, right? It's in your graveyard for later. And they needed a land, so yeah, I think they should have drawn there. They found the land. I'm fine with the play memory the loose. They're just chilling, 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 chilling. We are drawing cards at the same rate, at a higher, faster rate than they are. Now they the loose. We take something. I'm scared about um temporary lockdown. That's the card that scares me. I don't know if that's a card they play. I should have played the waste not first. 
but I wanted to see to check if they had drawn a counter spell basically. Still fine. We're still doing very very fine. Going this way. I'm sorry, that was wrong. Going to this way. Verdict, but we draw two cards. Like this engine is very hard for them to stop. But they have answers, and we lack answers for their answers. Still ruining my castle? No, still ruining that. Do I want to be greedy and pay six life? I don't think so. I don't think I need to. We have floated mana and then activated the castle. I think that's a lot. So this version only plays eight trumps. Doesn't look like a lot to me. I like most of them. Going. Oh my god, my god, my god. How am I going to top the Maze Mind Tome thumbnail? That was. That was awesome. Okay, we need a Liliana. To start getting useless cards out of our hand. Because basically we have all blanks now. At some point, then we'll find something. Are they going for the Aharkas memory they use now? No, March of the other world. Go blank would be great because it would take the memory they use out of the way. May have to start paying 7 life to draw a card with Castle Lowell. Which I don't love, my dear. This is insanity. Okay, that one is good. Okay, that one is good too. No, they found a sword. No, I don't think I want to search specifically for anything. I was thinking about a bow blank, but I don't have the mana to cast it. Okay. Okay, rich sanitarium is nice. Hmm. Out. That's a good one. Airbag, not terrible. So now I do this and I replay Sheldred from the graveyard. That seems amazing. Yeah. <clears throat> I lose a bunch of life, but maybe I should have kept the fate at least because of the Sarta Typhoon. Yeah, that, that maybe was a mistake. To start by doing this. Interesting. I mean, I understand the idea of doing this, but I'm not sure. Because you get to loot rather than just rather than, than just discarding, <coughs> you get to actually loot. Let's 
Pero que yo me hizo el de los bonds. Ay. And it's a copy, so I don't get into a real one. Okay. Well, found a push anyway. Now I go push this. Play dress. Do this to do. <laughs> oh, oh, well, I can keep going. Um, it's fine. I don't want to pay more now. So you just keep going. You do it again and again and again and you just keep going. It's pretty awesome, I must say. I could... Is there anything here I could take? I could play the Avarice. Search for a Seldred. I think we're Sell it or a castle. Okay, let's do this. Uh, I want to put the command on graveyard. I want to attack a land. Okay, that was an interesting tool. Let's see. They have the Sar Typhoon, so any wood draws are going to be very very bad for us <clears throat> no a second spell the ferry wow 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 you may be dead no Going to cast a push on the big shark. Okay, I understand what Kyrex is, is cool. Just we're a bit too low on life. That seven life we paid with the castle log win is going it's making the difference. I don't like it. That's a good draw. Beautiful draw. Because we know they have a land in front. Go blank is probably decent because of the memory they lose they have in the graveyard. I'm going to be able to use the ferry and draw. That's scary. But I'm feeling. I'm not feeling bad about this game. And once the Aklaso starts getting us life, we can start using the Kyrex ability again. And that's amazing. Hundred percent blocking with the attack. With the Atlas. I just want my life. Cyclas comes back, so we can play Phil of Ruin and kill it. It will be annoying. Okay. Oh, you have a follow up. Some fool. Cool. Annoying. Annoying, annoying. But we have some life to work with now. Mummy, such a red rock. Didn't draw.
now if you can find an answer for Silver, like right now, we're just going to win. This is why you play Silver. <laughs> it's, it's the only card that does this kind of thing. It's insane how we do this. We have two draws to kill us. Like the, this draw step and the Teferi draw step. We don't find something super murdery. One day then play. Okay. A silent Aklan shot is fine. But. Soldier can just win the game alone. No, 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 please. Please, please, please. Another shot of Doom, wow, that's impressive. Very impressive. Planeswalkers are annoying. We don't have good ways of killing them. No, really. By casting Saltex. Like a Numa. Mm. Better than Go Blank, I guess. We discarded a lot. Finger Sacrifice. Yes, I can. Channel Takenuma, see if I find anything of relevance. No. Okay. This is where we're gaining a bunch of life in the process. Uh, do I want to attack? I don't think so. I could attack. Because I have the the backup. They are five. Bye bye, solid. Bye bye, Lee. Down to fourteen, which is not a, it's actually that's fourteen damage. <laughs> but so that will help with that. Not always not. That's something interesting. Probably better than the second Lilia now. Maybe not. Okay, they lose. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Whenever they lose, it's problematic. Bitter Triumph, not bad. Bitter Triumph, not bad. No, Bitter Triumph is fine. I want to kill the Fenris because it's it's an answer to to solve it already. So okay, let's hope they don't kick me from here. I think are we dead on the air? I haven't counted. We may be dead. We're at 20, this is 10, 15, oh, that's 23, we're dead. So I should have killed one of the thingies. Should have counted. 
Oh, this is a different way. Hmm. Do we have all the tools to win this game? I need box bones, the big pocket, a playable card in this match. What don't I want? I want the, the Pain Walker's removal spells. Probably I don't want the card of the Prince. Well, no, it wasn't bad, right? It wasn't bad. It was the. <clears throat> drawing with that castle was a mistake. Seven life is way too much. Hmm? Maybe I don't want all the Evoke Whispers. They are way too heavy. Okay. Yes, I would like to. I would like to move on this hand. You just need land blocks. This hand is beautiful. No need to play that to this on turn one. There's nothing they can play on turn one. I would like to take. Much rather do this on turn two and see what they have. Avalice. Avalice is good. Okay, what is high moon? This player can cast more than one spell each turn and fi for five mana it does stuff. Okay. Uh I'm going to take the one day emperor. Okay. I think we are fine playing around the no more lies this this game. Also they don't have they didn't play the land to have the normal lies ready. That's interesting. That's an interesting choice. Oh, they found a counter spell. What are the dues? They discovered High Noon and Igandre. Okay. That's a good choice. In the turn here, they would probably fill a ruin our castle and we will draw in response for life. Is acceptable? Okay, perfect. That thought is will clear the way for the goblin. Hopefully, we just let them with no resources. Oh, high noon, so we cannot do that now. That's interesting. Well, then I will play my spells one by one. Um, hmm. I think I can... I will take the no more lights and then try to resolve a go blank next turn. They're using okay. Let's try to go blank and get that memory to use exiled. They, they will probably keep it in hand, to be honest. But, and they, as they should now, they just cast it. The problem with this is we are not doing anything, right? Just discarding cards from the hand, that's it. Prince Walker here would be annoying, but we have the Invoke Despair. So, um, they don't have a counter spell. This is our moment. They don't. I should have played the land beforehand. Ah, they found a counter. Ah, the deuce. 
still have played the land because what if I draw a wood tap land here? I hope during this league we get to kill somebody with this. Three mana to kill you? That sounds cool. Okay. Did you find a removal a counter spell for this? Doesn't seem so. Just going to draw three after this. Okay, that, those are some good hits. Removal spells are always rough when you have a Liliana, but we don't have a Liliana. I'm annoyed by the memory they lose in the graveyard. Uh, it is what it is. That's a good draw. I'm going to play this and name the Fairy Hero. Is like that and Sar Typhoon and the are the most scary cards they can have, but it's really hard to interact with Sar Typhoon. Plasma. Really, the lose is such a cool card. I don't think we can lose this matchup if that if that card didn't exist. <clears throat> the only thing I, I don't like about this matchup compared to the red black matchup versus this for example or vampires, you know, is that you cannot kill them. <laughs> right, so they always have time to rebuild and rebuild and rebuild, and that's annoying. It's very telling, very, very telling that they have chosen to kill that to kill them. Um, hmm. Here we go. Do we have a Teferi? That's my question. No, they have another Robin's Well, we're going to be top decking, buddy. It's like I'm drawing cards and I'm generating card advantage. But I'm not, I'm not finding any way of killing them and winning the game. So that's always annoying. Right away, use the Field of Ruin. That was a good top deck. We haven't seen any creature lands or utility lands in general from their side. To play this, activate the hive because hive is amazing. This way, we force them to use the memory they lose and we can make them discard with Liliana. That's the plan here. Dress. I don't really want to do this right now. They should have waited until we attack. Because what if now they had to discard another memory they lose? We could have sided it. So that, that wasn't great. I mean, a force for Hive. That's a way of finishing games. Death Ah, uh, we 
جانا نعم رغد ما يشوف كيف بعد الدرس Only one thing for us here, what we are doing, like I think we are in a very good spot, and mainly is because we have both Liliana at six and Zelda, right? So they have to choose. Because the fairy answers anything, but it only answers one thing. Of course, they can have a removal in hand, and that will change the situation. And after they the fairy minus on something, we still have the hive. So. Hmm. Memory values, memory values. What about this? In game, no, no fear. That's good. That's pretty good. They're just floating the thing here. Um, something like this looks fine. You do want to keep the bottom one. That makes sense. Do you have an answer here? The one there, yeah? Okay. What? Why would you do that? I think our opponent just misplayed the game away. Yeah. I mean, I think we were winning anyway, but that was a big, big misplay. In both this pair, very good versus the boy lockdown, right? So I have more of those. Maybe a class of sucks because they can exile it easily. Is. A needle is probably a needle is still fine. Uh, I'm going to take out one car break. That seems medium. Okay, this is a hand. Let's see. <laughs> That's a block. Use the views the fairy wandering. Just always taking the place walkers. Like car advantage is fine, but in the end, the place walkers are what matter. And we really suck at keeping them. Dobin's veto. I mean, you don't want to, Dobby, to play Dobin's veto. Kind of makes sense, right? Because if I take it, it's the same as countering, but they get to use the deduce, deduce, deduce. I'm going in again. So many discard removal. Discard. Targeted discard spells. 
Pues no. Versus the hand they had, this soldier would be awesome. But we're not there yet. Unless we draw this one. No problem. I mean, we have casted one for ones and they are casting two for ones, so we are way behind. But I think we will find a way to get to I'm going to cast Soldier here. I just want to trade resources until I can start using Gale Rich Sanitarium easily. I hope the clock doesn't become an issue for either player, so we can have a nice game. Oh, six mana. I know what this is. Can I draw a swamp? What a master. What a master. That was rough, huh, for them? You find your opening, you you slam down your Shark Typhoon and all of a sudden it's gone. Yeah, 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 this is fine. Okay, first Liliana. Classing. See if they give us mana or they give us cards. They give us mana. Mana is good. I have a second Lydia now. Oh, you have a counter spell? Wow. One diamond. Interesting. And the last card is probably another spell or another land, maybe. Be another land that would make sense, I think. No, another spell, so we draw a couple. Uh, nothing interesting there. I want to draw. Good draw, good draw. Wonderful draw. For those of you who didn't play Invoke Despair in a standard, it's a good way of killing your opponent. So maybe you don't know you don't even know the card. Like you can just play this, you draw three, your opponent loses six, and it's all the value in the world. Memory deluge. We have the perfect hand to contest a memory deluge here. Because of the goal plan. We are in the end step. Why are we doing all of this in the end step? I don't make a deal. We both discard a card. We'll discard. Maybe they just realized, right? That they did it in the end step. Of that. We'll go blank. So basically, three mana exile target memory deluge. I don't want to play Takenuma because I have a Seldred in the graveyard. I could, I could get. I just think we didn't play the, the first game very well. Now we just win. Because our opponent probably didn't want to play anymore. Hmm, this hand is not awesome. Phoenix. Phoenix matchup, I haven't still figured out. I don't love this cyborg we have. 
but we'll, we'll see. We'll see. Nothing and nothing. Hmm. I don't blame my waste not. If it's a counter spell deck, okay. If it's Phoenix, they have like two spell piercers in the deck. Uh -huh. So this is probably creativity, right? Or tra a transmogrify deck, something like that. And those matchups are hard because they just top deck so well. I'm kind of playing into their hand, right? Because they probably have a bunch of counter spells, but I just want to exhaust the resources, not let them do anything, and just land a Sildred and hope that kills them. Blue-red decks usually don't have an easy time killing Sildred. Okay. And now they miss a land deck. So yeah, when you have a Sildred, you always have a plan. That's why I was considering cutting it with a friend, but do I want to do that? Play other threats like planeswalkers, things that don't allow our opponents to, to use their removals. Maybe? I think at that point we should play Sildred in the, in the cyborg. Most probably. Okay, let me see your hand. Okay, so they have. A way to kill Sildred. Next turn. Then I will take the. I can play around, make this appear, I guess. Play the deduce. They can kill it in the upkeep. That will tap them out for the whole turn and I will play the other one. It's always the second cell there. That's the good one. The first one is just fine. Okay, and do it up. This is not great, but I think it's fine. We are draining their life and setting up for the next soldier to kill them easily. They may have fine land with that. So, for those of you who don't understand how this works, this is with soldier, this is similar to the killing a thermal wave with a lightning bolt. So, what kills soldier is state based effects because it has 4 damage on it, 5, five damage on it. So, if you use the draw ability from this, that resolves before we can check the state based effects. So, you take, you take two, basically. If it said destroy, then do that, you will destroy the soldier, put it into a graveyard, and then draw. But here, you de deal the damage, then you draw, and then soldier dies. And now our opponent dies too. We were to see a bunch of the deck. It's GG's. 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 Jejes. We got to choose how to kill them. Putting away. That was fine. Dures seems very good. Um, Push seems very bad. Tiny Bones. They have Fable. Whenever a opponent plays Fable, Tiny Bones is interesting. Could be Trespasser, you know? To put some pressure on. Just attack. It could be a knight. 
to mana to two that's I think we have they have better late game than we do so we just have to attack a bit and push just so very unplayable one okay I don't think I, I'm keeping a hand with no black black lands in my mono black deck this hand is the same but worse Taking down the sword red I mentioned this in the past, but this is one of the few decks in Pioneer that can easily shuffle, so putting something on the bottom of the deck is not necessarily a death sentence for that card. Just use a fill of ruin and shuffle it back into the deck. Okay, we are lacking black mana, that sucks. Next turn we can go to this plus Maze Mind Dome. I'm going to use the scry ability, I think. If they play, if they play a fable here. That's annoying. Yeah, fable indeed. Can I find something good? You are not. There one. It kind of counts. Yeah, 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 I'm doing it right away. I wanted, I didn't have the upkeep trigger, but I wanted to scry because I, I wanted to find more more black sources. Next turn, hopefully we can go to res plus go blank. And that may be helpful. Technically, you want to, do re to go blank first and then play the targeted removal, targeted discard. But that only happens if they tap out. And if they tap out, we'll be in trouble because it's probably for a, either another fable or a creativity of some sort. Black land. Let's play that. Let's see what hand they have. Negate. Mm -hmm. Discard the pathway and disappear. Okay. They have a creativity now for Atraxa, that would be annoying. I wouldn't mind finding an answer for that reflection. Or for that Atraxa, because this is an Atraxa. So this is like an Atraxa, and it is an Atraxa. Okay, they reveal a lot of cards. Let's do... They took Negate. Activity. Can I find a Liliana? Not you. Not you either. Not you either. <laughs> okay, uh, we're in a rough spot right now. We have Negate, Creativity, Fable, and Mirror. That's the Mirrex. Second creativity, not that scary. Fable, very scary, as usual. Now I don't think we can win. We we'll probably negate this. No, they're just going to negate the whatever removal spell we find. I guess solder will help us stay alive. 
it's not that's not a good way, way to live Create and creativity means we need a dot six a removal and then another answer for the next address. Which we have two answers left in the deck for next. Let's this a class up will help. Lily. Yeah, Lily not it's not it. Can try to resolve it, but let me do this and I'm going to play the Aklas out and block the Rasa gain some time. Aklasot is probably not great in this matchup. Is better than push. Hmm. Okay. The mirror is kind of annoying. Actually, I also have to kill it at some point. Is this? Oh. Oh. I didn't expect. Now there's like no way to get out of this situation. Did I, for any reason, forget to take out the, the leak over up? That will help. Oh, I didn't take it out. Okay, 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 okay. Draw. Draw. No. <laughs> Let me die. Just imagine, huh? We find a deadly cover up there. And that's game. That's game to be played. Uh. <laughs> What's in our cyborg that we could want? Tiny bones? Just tiny bones? A car? We want anything? So. I don't think we're running it like this. We just have to. Like, they had a very good hand. And we were missing some some discard spells. We need some interaction. Okay, this is a hand. No, this is a very good hand. Discard. Maze Mind Tome, discard. The same, we'll have to put the Aklasot back. But still, it's very good. Okay. Uh, that's solid. I'm going to take the Fable, because it's a Fable, and it's so scary. And we're going to play the Maze Mind Tome, probably Scry, to find out. Find a third land. Maybe not. So we want to thought seize the Prismari command and the Sarte Tomb. So that's a bit of annoying. A bit annoying. Oh. Nah, I think we're. Still fine like this. They have the volcanic sprite in hand. We're probably taking the creativity here. At some point you just have to without a creativity they cannot really win, right? So I went to impulse, I guess. Let the thought seize before drawing because make disappear is a card that exists. Okay, they found a land. Are they going to kill my Maze Mind Tome? Doesn't seem so. Then I will draw. 
hope to find something super the problem is if they try to combo with a creature yeah we can kill it but if they defuse and then creativity on the blue token there's nothing we can do there okay loot for two and make a treasure they don't care about my character seems they are in dire need of lands if we find what will we find that would make Kyrbeck a great draw just a reward spell no thanks uh, uh sorry a discard spell that's not bad. Yeah, I'm going to play it. It's better than activating the maze mind tome. We need lands, but we are not in a terrible spot right now. They discarded Sar Typhoon. Interesting. They discarded two Sar Typhoons. And the sprites are there. Okay, so the sprites the sprite is gone. Hey. Mm -hmm. Table is fine. Let me scry. Land there. Activate an arm. I want to play Kyrbeck here. If we end up with that car break, it's going to be awesome, but we have to get there. They have already used two volcanic sprites. That's not nothing. Ideally, I would like to. They discarded indomitable creativity. Hmm? Why? <laughs> Why would you do that? What do you have in hand? So they could, they could have the crab. They could have another creativity. Creativity for two here. Problematic and annoying. Okay. At least we have two answers in, in hand for the two creatures they have. And that's pretty good. Right? What are they playing? They took Shark Typhoon, Socken Sun, Deduce, and Creativity. That was out of track, sir. Okay, how are we going to play this game? I need to sell the Sedic here. Make them sacrifice a non token. Yeah, that's what I need. They have to choose, they will probably choose to keep the whole breaker horror. I want to triumph the whole breaker horror. And then do the rest right. Am I going to go 
want to play another thing. Yeah, I think I'm going to play the edit. I sacrifice a cube to the top. Mostly that's a wood to the moon. I take the typhoon, right? I, ca I can manage the creativity. I take the, the typhoon. Wow. Okay, Carabek, huh? That was so impressive. Maybe it was, I, I, I'm not sure it was the best way to play the tune, but it was impressive. Now they can creativity on that. Reveal something. Sock and sun. Interesting choice. I for sure thought they were going to creativity. I will spray just to gain the life. Also to oh, that's nice. Okay. To this you and um, go blank or bitter. <coughs> Go blank will let them with no hand, but I think I just want to pay, kill, kill the favor. This is going to be a hefty price to pay. And that's fine, I don't, I don't want to. I just want to take the creativity out of their hand. I need a soldier. Why would you deduce when I have the duress on the stack? It's a choice, that's for sure. The creativity and they have two cards. Okay, they don't have much here. So. We're at eight. If we find a silver, we can really, really close this game out. We have the avarice in hand, we can find anything we want. Mirex is going to be problematic. Our favor. Mm -hmm. That's good. That's good. I know nothing of their hand right now. I think I'm going to Avaris for five. No, I'm just going to this for two. Want to be able to play something, something else this turn. They have a counter spell. Okay. He didn't counter the 3 mana draw 3, probably because it's 3 damage for us. Ah, Fable, such a good card. Second Mirrex, where are our field of ruins? Not sure we are beating those Mirrex. Probably not, with how the game is looking right now. Oh, wow, I forgot about that. Oh, what a good draw. Oh, this makes a crime too. It commits a crime. So now I can, if I want to, I can Liliana. Do I want to commit a crime? But no, no, I don't, I don't want to pay life. I'm happy like this. That was a good draw. Mirrex token and Mirrex token. 
the rough spot for us. There's two more keytos in the graveyard, so that's two more life we can gain with the graveyard trespasser. I guess we have search for the silver. I think if I play it for five, they just counter it. Maybe not, but that's nice. I may have to use the Gaia Bridge Sanitarium here, which is never great. But I, I, yeah, I just need to find action. First of all, I need to kill that. Soldier, 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 soldier. Not a soldier. That would. You are very good. Okay, let's see. This is going to be. Risky, risky business. Yeah, I think I want to do this. Hold on to two life. Maybe I die. Maybe I just die. Hope to find something. It's just like we are not winning from the game right now, even if I don't play these cards. To life on Gerbeck really adds up. Okay. Chandra Awakened Inferno. Yeah, I'm taking that one. Come on, something good. Seldred. Do you are you enough? Not two life, so that's not enough. You were enough before. So we were dead to the Chandra anyway. We got grinded by all the tokens and everything. I mean, they did resolve a creativity for two that was powerful. Uh, but if I don't play that Thought Sister, I could have attack with the Gravia Trespasser. I don't know. Uh, this curve car, I, I don't know how to play it. So, literally, my first day with it. There has to be a better way of playing it. Okay. 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 Mm. Forest. Death Right Summon. I need to see your hand. Oh, 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 well, Insidious Root seems extremely annoying versus us, because we have no way of taking it out, and it seems like a way to win the game. Kibar is good also, but costs one more mana. Not a Soul Caldron, huh? Maybe Soul Caldron was the pick. I'm not sure about that. I'm going with the waste. I'm going with the waste node, but it could be Maze Mind Tome. The, the choice here. It could be Maze Mind Tome. Yeah, Kibar. Mill Pool. Mm. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. I'm fine with the sunken citadel and keeping push up for whatever comes. But I'm also fine with swamp maze mind dome. But of course. So 
just do that. I can start scrying, searching for something, which that something is most certainly a go blank. We found a land, now we can activate the Dirt Bike Summon for mana. There's of course a, a combo here, all these cards are combo cards. Well, not the right, but all the other cards are combo cards. So. There's of course a, a combo somewhere. Let's find something. Should we play the other two out? Need three. Oh, Priest of the Forgotten Gods with this thing. Oh, that's so powerful. Because you sacrifice two of these and you get black, black. You know, so activate this, sacrifice two for second miners, commit a crime, and you get black black. So with that black black, you pay this. Then you activate the bar, get this back. And then you activate Agatha Soul Cannon, give something the ability of this. And maybe it's not infinite, but I'm pretty sure you can get your opponent quick, quickly, quickly dead. So we are in a rough spot. <laughs> Let me miss my topic. My keep. Go blank has to be at least decent. Because we really want to exile the graveyard. So let's do that. We have activated the sanitarium and if we hit a land. I don't think that's worth it. Agatha Soul Caldon, that makes sense. Also, we are just dying to the board. I hope we get something done before we die to the silly two choos and one choos, but we are dying. No doubt. They found something good? That seems good. Nothing. Upkeep, I'm going to activate Maze Mind Tom again. We're looking for. <sighs> Deadly cover up sounds okay. Removal sounds okay. That is all color and some other thing. Oh, we are. Oh, yeah. The Varga gives haste to the people of Sight for that. Okay, we're searching for another miner. Wow. So cool. It's a cool deck. Now they can plus one Tibar if they want to activate something else. Like that. Can I get a deadly cover up here? It's the only rat we are playing, so. No. Okay. Because we are doing way too fair things for our, what our opponent is doing. So we are basically dead on board. So we need our rules there now. Yeah. Not bad. I think we are dead. Wow. No idea what's going on. But I think we are just dead. So, things. Pretty sure. Let's see if our opponent shows us the, what they are doing exactly. The second miner comes back. Because of the art, wow. Synergy, huh? 
Have this deck ever beat a Leyline of the Void? We, not that we have them, because we don't have them in, the, in this list. I think now we are there. Like, but we are going to get to see the combo thingy, and that's pretty cool. Seed of Hope. Mill 2. And you may return something. You gain 2 life. Do I sacrifice this? They can activate QR to do that again. And then they can add a soul card on another creature to do that again. I don't know how to make this infinite, but it does seem like we are going down. Like we are dead. We are dead. Okay. But I want to know how the deck functions. Is it Needle? We could name Agatha Soul Caldron. Piece of the Forgotten, which is not great because of the Soul Caldron. We are dead on board, but I don't think they are going to do anything else, just attack. So, it was quite something, huh? I don't think we want to do this. We want to sting an event. Ooh, Trespass and Path of Peril sound good. Needle sounds good. Tiny Bone sounds great in this match. Maze Mind Tome sounds mm, bad. So does the Avaris. Like, I don't think it's. A it's going to be about card advantage, it's going to be about controlling the board. And Lily sounds actually very bad. Wow, we got destroyed. We have a couple of removal spells, a waste note and a soldier. Let's just combo deck. Soldier is your best card because you need to kill that. And this is completely a combo deck. Huh? It's a creature deck too. I think I will use my turn 2 to deploy a waste node. Which is always hard to find a spot for it. Never mind. <laughs> Pretty cool. Another way, no? And no lands. Sometimes I just want to play 27 lands. Not even an extra utility land, just an extra swamp. Sidious Roots, that's the card that beats us, right? Oh, maybe that's what makes it infinite. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. With the Soul Caldron and that, you just go infinite, right? Because you keep growing. Oh, yeah, this is what makes the deck infinite. Oh, my goodness. I'm going to kill that thing. No, I'm going to take two. And try to kill something better. Insidious roots. Like that. Killing that seems a lot better. Well, if they play another creature, I'm just going for the path of peril. This is so interesting. Such a cool deck. I should try to play. <laughs> 
Uh, I'm assuming they have nothing in hand because they literally just pass the turn. They could have collected company, but if I thought it's and they have a collected company, it's the same. And at least this way we have a plug. Where were my my waste not hasn't do hasn't done much. Went to Thotsis, probably final land. Yeah. Oh, was it you, huh? Will attack. Get them to block and sack. And in response to the activation, I will use my Gale Rich Sanitary, my friend. Oh, they commit a crime. Oh my god. Commit a crime now. I can bring that team back and it triggers insidiously. Wow. He's dead. This deck is awesome. <laughs> I have no words. This deck is awesome. However, might be part of the all these synergies. Makes it so well, you don't die to a random Leyline of the Void, for example, as we were mentioning, right? What is this thing? Okay, so this leaves. Oh, wow, this leaves your graveyard, so it triggers insidious roots again. Wow. Wow. I'm in love. I'm in love. No more. <sighs> they have say you here. Not using it. Just using it on the yeah. That makes sense. If I want to shuffle their library, I'm fine if they draw the, that thing, right? It's not a great blocker or anything. Or is it a great blocker? I don't know. I don't think it is. So I don't want to block. I don't, I don't want to kill the Chuchu. -chu. So that is going to be awesome. An awesome way to win. Oh, that's a 5-5. Five -five. So, let's hope we don't die. It's a supplier. We can beat that, I think. I hope. Okay, yeah, that, that, that wasn't great. Are you attacking? I'm chumbling. I promise you that. Okay, so we are going to have a decent turn next turn. I'm going to do this. Play the path of peril, kill the board, and attack for advance. They can add mana and maybe they find something good with the Stitcher Supplier. Doesn't seem so. So now we attack for 7 and they have one draw start. I think we are covered. Soldred is just like 
it does stuff in all the card pass. Wins without engaging in combat. It's a super fast clock. It's Mm, I think we need Invoke Despair because it kills an enchantment. And I think Liliana sucks. Something like this. This seems like a very bad hand. No early interaction of any kind. And this, on the other hand, seems awesome. I want all of them. <laughs> you know, Pithy Needle? Maybe sucks. I want them to play a bunch of creatures. I want to path of peril those creatures. And then. I go blank. That's something too. Uh, has to be insidious roots, right? It's better than Soul Cauldron. Is it? I think so. Maybe I'm wrong, huh? I need a good draw here. A land would be fine because it will assure me I have another land for later. Oh, was that the pick? Hmm, maybe. Okay, 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 that, that could work. Because now if I la draw a land, I can go, go blank, get a couple of triggers. You know? Freeze or Agatha Soul Calder. Freeze. Even the Soul Calder in hand is a bit risky, I think. You can discard it at any point. Land. No land. So. Not looking so great right now. Any creature is great for them. Which they already have. One, yeah. A land would be awesome. That works. Doesn't matter what we hit here. I hope we find a land and a non creature. But even a land and a creature would be fine. We found a non creature and a creature. That's, I wanted a land. I really needed to hit a land. The path of peril. We hit ideally we hit a land and a non creature, which I don't think it was possible because you know they have missing land drop, have been missing land drops. Okay, can I draw a swamp? Is that too much to ask for? Sure, that works. Do I want to uh, be greedy and activate Gaia Rate Sanitary? Could do that. It's really it's super greedy for me. I think I'm not going to be greedy. I'm just going to kill the board. They can activate the priest and they should probably. Just draw a lamb. Draw a card, so. Yeah, eleven. Sacrifice a creature. And then they use the third right summon again and we go down to nine. We have played the Seldred. Try to get them to overcommit a little bit. But I think this this is safer. Maybe it's not. Insidious roots. That seems problematic for us. We just play my red saying go and whatever happens happens. If they don't draw something good this turn, if they draw a blank, we just win. Their deck work a bit. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. They don't need to draw anything. Oh my god. Because they have the insidious root 
and the Agatha Soul card, no? So they don't really need to do, to do anything other than keep activating the Agatha Soul card. No? This deck is blowing my mind. Now they can activate Soul Caldron with another token and use the. Wow, my goodness. This is really something. They draw a card and they don't lose life. We have explained how that works. Okay. So bo this combo is insane. Now I think I'm using the gate of the same card. I don't think so that is enough with this. What what's going on here? Okay, now it's fine because I can have both. So my soldier doesn't die. And they need to draw a creature, which probably they have in hand because they will let them do. See what? That sounds like we are dead. I think we are dead. On board, they activate Soul Cadron, sell the Forgotten Priest, activate the Priest. Well, we have a second blocker, so we are not dead dead. We are just close to being dead. This is amazing. I don't think Leyline would be good. I like playing Leyline on the cyborg because I think it's fine versus Fenny. How to that? You may activate abilities of creatures you control as though as those creatures have, has, have haste. Cut, cut. Yeah, now they can sacrifice this and this to this thing. Oh, they are using. Oh my goodness. But now, now I have a blocker. So I'm not dead. Or am I? No, no, because this doesn't have a counter. They have another creature. No, we're not dead yet. We're close to that. One life. I'm very impressed. Also, I don't know what's going on, so I'm probably not playing optimally. That, that happens a lot. Second Soul Caldron. Now we are dead. No. No, no, because they need to keep the old one to win. Yeah, no, no, that's not how it works. Um, totally need to deadly cover up here, right? Exile, Herbeck, and Soldred. I'm going to get a Stitcher Supplier Trigger. That sucks. I'm going to get the Forsaken Miners. And I need them to not draw anything for like three turns in a row. Probably one turn in a row. No. More turns. I mean three. Okay. Oh! No! <laughs> okay, yeah. <laughs> Exiling the creep. Oh, yeah, I gave. Oh, my goodness. 
Wow, what a day. Why are we losing so much? Because I'm playing terrible. Yeah. Okay, last round with a very quick hand. Okay, it's interesting. It's a bad hand. But at least we have Lily and Waste Note, which is a decent combo. I'm going to put down a class out. It's a five drop after all. <laughs> They're not very well equipped to beat a mono red deck, but could be red black, you know, old, old school red black. No, but what hand did they keep that had the oh, okay, okay, that's what they wanted to do. That's fine. Go blank, not a terrible though. Avaris. Terrible to have it in hand, Kerbeck, this is a 3-3. Three -three. They're going to have a tough time deploying the skewer. The critics, so that's something. Boy. Gitu? Gitu Lava Runner? Another Kumano. Now they can skewer if they want. Wow. If they have a land, they just play the Gitu. Wow. That was awesome. That was a great, a great play. I'm going to Liliana, kill the Gitu Lava Runner, hopefully get attack. So we gain some life back. This hand on the play would have been so much better. As it usually happens, right? Are you attacking Liliana or are you attacking me? That's always a question. You have to answer. Well, 3 mana, kill a key to gain some life, that was fine. Um, this is a decent draw, but I think, I think, I think, I want to play the all blank first. That's the last couple of cards they have. Could include a... Okay. What's the last card in your hand? Non creature. A monstrous red. Uh, 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 this soldier is going to be late. Maybe. Go down to five, technically. That's fine. Go down to two, that's not fine. Push. Not a push. Skewer was a wood top deck. But I think we were dead anyway. Even if I, if I play the sword, I think we die anyway. Huh. Those passers seems good. Uh, I do like Maze Mind Dome here. Garbage is fine, right? That's a 3 3 that blocks. Some number of duresses are good. Go blank is just bad. They, they empty their hand way too fast. Mono red. Fine hand. No interaction, but the main mind tome can go a long way at finding some. And trespasser is just so key. 
on the draw it would have been a mulligan, obviously. Wanna start ch charging this? Right. Looking for more. Okay, so soldier seems good enough to keep on top. Take one, are they going to light up the stage or something similar? Skewer the critics, anything of the sort. <laughs> light up the stage. Okay, some reckless symbols. Not very scary. Soul scar, that's weird. Cross passion. Eat that. So the lava runner doesn't have. Now, I want to stop here and just search for, uh, for lands or interactions. Okay, playing the case of the Crimson Fools. This car and draw two. Uh, yeah, that's fine. It's going for Soldat here. The scries are not being very helpful. Just keeping the cars on top. Master is Swiss Spear and does the battlefield. I'm never blocking for that actually. What do you have post combat? Light up the states, that makes sense. Without lining and mount. So, this card makes it so annoying, right? Because they can just kill your your creatures over several turns with the minus one minus one counters like that not going to kill it right now but you know you get the idea Yeah, I think I'm interested in a land. Actually. Why is not? I don't just want to do this. Wow. 
I'm going to attempt to block. Okay. They cannot really, they cannot easily kill the graveyard to spasso. Eh? They can use the wizard. I mean, playing that land was weird, I guess. If they just activate then, I will block it. Hope they just go then attack, but I don't think that's a good play for them. They can with us line in the graveyard as passive, discarding another land. Discarding, sorry, discarding the other skewer, the other with us line in the shuffle hand. Okay, maybe the end. I'm just a blocking here. I need to take more damage than necessary. This solved the case, that's problematic. But it's also weird because we have the waste node, so they are going to be discarding car hand. Kind of pillar win, right? Can do it next turn. Uh do I want to exile anything? They have one play with fire, two, skewer, two skewers, no, I don't think so. I'm going to do it like this. And see what they do. If they attack with the den of the bugbear, they have the gap. So it's the case, I guess. Let me. The beginning of your upkeep, discard your hand, then draw two. That will probably trigger my, my waste node at some point. Especially if they now attack with the land. They have three cards in hand, so there's no reason to attack with the land. Okay, okay. Oof, they can do everything. So powerful for them. So Ramuna Province annoying too. Since they are deciding. What to do, what to do, what to do here. They passed the turn, they didn't attack or they didn't okay. Interesting. I'm going to play my Carver again. What do they have? Let's see what happens. They have a land in hand. I don't think they do, but if they have a land in hand, this will be this is going to be very interesting. I hope they do. I hope they have a land in hand and now they're just activating Ramona Ruins. No they don't. Kind of sucks. Let's see what they do with the scry. Let's cry the bottom. Okay. 
I could if I wanted, kill or ruin, and then thought this, but that's for life. I don't want to pay for life. Could also, when they were out of cards, I could have activated the Gaia Rich Sanitarium. This is so hard to grind through. Creative Codebreaker hard cast. Okay. Any extra spell aside from that? Oh, that's like per dead, right? They are basically dead here. Okay, we found a blocker. We are not dead. But we are dead. How are we even getting out of this situation? I'm jump blocking here. Need them to not draw anything in like five draw, in three draws. Oh, that's, that's not happening. Yeah, now we are dead. If they draw three lands, we are not dead. Any spell kills us, so please just so. ah, this wasn't a great league, right? Uh, what do I think about the new cards? Now I have to think about that. Try trying them. There's no, where's the Avarice here? Ah, oh, here, here for some reason. Avarice was medium, it's just rough to play sometimes, not affecting the board and all. Probably worth it, like, is it better than the fourth main, main, main tome? It's been a similar card, maybe not. Fairbeck was nice, this was powerful, but it's maybe a cyborg card, because Problem is all about the removal, right? And it's three mana, three three, and then you pay a lot of life and everything. Tiny bones haven't really get chance to play it. Probably okay. I think I would keep trying this one and move the carbex to the cyborg. Pay less invoke disperse. Pay a second deadly cover up. Really like it. Hmm. Liliana is so weird. Sometimes it's so bad. Maybe Liliana sucks. S thing I still like Sildred, but I would like to play a version. I would like to play a version with no creatures. So I take this out and play like Liliana for uh, showing planes walkers that affect the board the turn they you play them. So place workers that can defend themselves. I don't know. I need to think about this. But I didn't love how I played today, so that's also important. 
but well, I hope you like learning with me because that's why I do this and I will see you in the next video tomorrow. Bye.